The first step is inspecting micro cardboards. Operators carefully check for defects like scratches or damage and remove. The next step involves precise glue dispensing and chip bonding. A small amount of adhesive is applied to the designated spot on the board, followed by carefully placing the chip onto the adhesive. The main control chip is bonded to the microcard. Precise glue is dispensed onto the designated position, and the main control chip is carefully placed and aligned. After bonding the main control chip and dies, a thorough inspection is conducted to ensure accuracy and quality. Once the main control and die bonding have passed inspection, the qualified boards proceed to the packaging process. During this step, an encapsulation material is applied to protect the chips and ensure durability. The precision of laser technology ensures that irregular or complex designs are accurately cut without damaging the components. After laser cutting creates the custom shapes, water jet cutting is used to separate the shaped cards into individual units, preparing the cards for the next processing. In this step, an automated sorting machine is used to categorize the microcards based on their memory models. Advanced sensors and algorithms quickly identify the memory specification of each card and sort them into designated categories. In the final step, the microcards are placed into an automated testing machine. The machine runs diagnostics through computer-based data analysis, checking for performance, memory capacity, and functionality. Defective products will be displayed on the computer screen. After passing all tests, the qualified microcards are carefully packaged. Microcards can be used in digital cameras, CCTV cameras, drones, AR devices.